Hey guys, Tomo Orange 927 here, doing a part two of my previous rant from my last video. Keep in mind, guys, that you know, like I said before, I'm not saying this to offend 343 Industries. I'm just saying this for the sake of making them a better company. Yeah, the whole idea works. Let's just get to the point. So, I know what you're asking first. Why am I showing you Destiny gameplay when you know I'm ranting on Halo? Well, guess what? MCC gets to the point where it doesn't work, it's literally impossible to get a match, so... Yeah, I'm actually playing a game that actually works, so... Yeah, guys, there's your answer. Now, on to the point. I just... Zone I don't B get it. I, I, I honestly don't get how MCC turned out like this. And it's just not... It's Enemy not just the connection zone. issues. It's zone literally the options you have, the stuff. Left. Like, don't get me wrong. Halo 2 Anniversary runs well. Everything runs zone well. A. For one, how is customization options so limited? How is, you know, how is the options in general so limited? How is it hard setting up custom games and stuff? I just, I don't get it. I, I really don't get it. I just, not to mention, like I said, it's been three months and the game hasn't been fixed. I, I, I will not get over that, guys. So, just deal with it. If you don't want to hear it, go to another video. So... Yeah, but like I said, guys, before a long time ago, I can't rant on self while the purpose of offering a solution, but, you know, the solution's pretty simple. Fix the game. That's, that's really all people are asking at this point. Just to prevent the game from being broken, and yet, like, because... Like, I'm serious, I have the question, is Halo 5 gonna turn out like this? Of whether or because seriously, we don't know if Halo 5 is gonna be good, or whether or not it'll even work. We don't know that until the final product releases. So guys, this is something that I would lead to, and guys, I know you're gonna be quite shocked at this, especially of how excited I am for Halo 5 as a whole, but I'm not pre-ordering the game. I am not pre-ordering Halo 5 because I've realized many fans, I am lucky enough not to be one of those fans, but many fans have made the mistake of pre-ordering MCC because they thought that 343 was like awesome and you know, they could handle it, but they couldn't. Like, I'm serious, why is it that they made it on one disc? That the four games on one disc thing is not an excuse because I don't think they had to do that. I don't think someone literally, like, like threatened them, saying, put all four games running at 60 frames per second, 1080p, on Xbox One, or else you're dead. No one threatened that. I'm pretty okay, sure most people would have been satisfied with just Heavy Halo 2 Anniversary with the classic and remastered multiplayer. But no, 343 did all four games because they said to themselves, we can handle it. We can handle this job. And and they just proved, they just proved to us that they couldn't handle it. And 343, please don't make th mistakes like this with Halo 5. Please don't. I You're beg of you. Yet, I beg of you. Don't screw up Halo 5. Please. And fans, if you're watching this, um, send 343 more feedback. Um, if you enjoyed this video, like this video up, guys, and yeah, keep it calm, and thanks for watching the video. Like I said, like this video, subscribe, and shout out to Dusk Thunder 9 he does videos like myself. So yeah, guys, this is Orange 927 and peace out. A neutralized.